So for all you Tudor lovers, here is Hatfield House where Mary Tudor and uh, Princess Elizabeth, the future Elizabeth I, spent part of their childhood in less than happy circumstances. So let's go and investigate. That was uh, Lord Cecil's Jacobean mansion in the early 17th century, but this is where Elizabeth and Mary spent many of their childhood years effectively under house arrest. Mary Tudor was held as a virtual prisoner here because she refused to recognize Henry VIII's second wife, Anne Boleyn, as the Queen of England because his first wife, her mother, Catherine of Aragon, she recognised as being the legitimate Queen of England. Also, Mary Tudor opposed Henry VIII's Protestant reforms. She was a die-hard Catholic and after her father died, she'd become Queen and exact a terrible revenge on all those Protestants who'd overturned the Catholic Church in England. So having spent a big part of her childhood here, Elizabeth eventually became queen and her chief advisor ended up being the person who ran this place, who was effectively her host during much of her childhood, Cecil, who would become her trusted advisor throughout her life and his son would then become the trusted advisor to her successor, James I. you 
enjoyed this visit to Hatfield House and if you do want to visit and you're coming to England especially from abroad it's up the A1 road write that down coming out of London the A1 coming out of North London it's really not far at all about half an hour 40 minutes so do come and visit Thank you.